hovering and moving. First, I'm going to rotate the aircraft so the orientation is the same out here as it will be for you at home, with the front facing away from you. Okay, first let's turn on the motors. Pull both sticks down and in. The motors will begin spinning. This is most commonly known as arming the motors. Now, to get the aircraft off the ground, push the left stick or throttle up. Now, once you have it at the desired height, return the stick to its neutral position. Notice that the aircraft will hover in place by itself and the motors are in an idle state, waiting for your commands through the remote controller. All right, let's try out the control sticks. Now, when I push the left control stick up, the aircraft rises. When I pull the left control stick down, the aircraft lowers. By pushing the left control stick to the left, the aircraft will rotate to the left, and by pushing the left control stick to the right, the aircraft will rotate to the right. All right, now to the right control stick. To move the aircraft forward, push the right control stick forward. To move the aircraft backwards, pull the right control stick towards you. To move the aircraft to the left, push the right control stick to the left. And to move the aircraft to the right, push the right control stick to the right. And those are the basic movements. Okay, let's try landing. Pull the left control stick down slowly, but not all the way. Try not to lower your aircraft at high speeds. Now, just before your aircraft touches down, move the left control stick back to center position and let the aircraft hover. Then gently pull the left control stick all the way down for a nice soft landing. Now, to turn off the motors, pull the left stick down for more than three seconds until the motors stop. You've now completed your first flight.